What's up guys, this is the Riffin and I am back to bring you the next episode of my Empire Total War Let's Play as Denmark. So to run off upon last time, we have continued fighting in the Indias, that was the bulk of our effort. And we have Bruno Osling that desperately needs to replenish his troops with whatever whatever money they can. Um, actually, do I want to do a bit of jigging? Probably not massively so, there's not... This unit's triple experience, but they're probably not going to last because they're only 81 men strong. Oh, yeah. Combine two to make it 214. Uh, two chevrons. That's still good. Um, but yes, our focus is still the Indians. And previously we had... Well, I had completely buggered up an, an attack against Berlin. Um, but what I'm tempted to do is actually see if I can get peace with Prussia for now. Because they, we have no real... So the, so the risk, as I see it, is if I took Berlin, that would inspire other armies or other nations to declare war on me, and Berlin would be a very fortified outpost. Um, so in reality, I'd probably want just to harass them from the sea, but not do much beyond that. Let's get this infantry into the fort. These pikemen can go to... This artillery fall, I suppose. Um, so the battered remains of this army that's in Copenhagen, which is currently being upgraded, and the army in London that is being formed. Well, actually, no, the army in London ne London needs to stay just in case the Marathas, the Mughals, sorry, um, misbehave themselves. So this army in Copenhagen will be shipped to India to support my gains there. Hyderabad is... It's a, it's a decent garrison with Torsten Nyholm. Um, but the hope is Bruno can move up to take Kutak. Um, Frederick Carlson can, after a bit of a bit of replenishment, um, re-engage against Goa, or potentially actually just swap some troops. Such as... Is there anyone that can leave the territory? Good, so we can get these marines out. I can get this triple rank unit of company infantry in and combine them with this triple rank unit. Good. So they stay max strength. Not so my cavalry can't help but do a lot of replenishment. I can't merge gun teams either. I can merge gun teams. In which case then I'll do this. Then probably fold you into that unit. Bring my marines back. Spend whatever money we've got left on a bit of replenishment. It's a shame about the grenadiers. It's nice to have a quadruple chevron experience unit with four units of experience, but need must. We must fix. They must be replenished. And then we also have this army here that's about to land and hit Santo Domingo. So the idea would be to take this province. Then try and get peace with Spain. And if they refuse, take Cuba, try to get peace with Spain. That's my goal. And I have actually just noticed that France has taken Philadelphia and Albany. So the 13 colonies are getting picked apart and France is growing, growing in the Americas as well as in Europe itself. So let's put you near Paris so we can keep an eye on what Paris is doing. Still only dirt roads, though. So Württemberg is armed up, but that's what all minor German states do in this game. Ooh, go on then. Do we trade, try trade with Austria? May as well. Fair enough. 13 colonies, let's try trade with you. Excellent. Greece is unfriendly, but let's see them as an, as an opportunity to bring them on the side. Oh, no. I could try to give them money, but I want to give them money. They really... <laughs> Venice really did not like the idea of trading with me. Yeah, fair enough. 25,000 a turn. See, we are being... Sea trade routes are being raided. 
That's why we'll probably need to grow and grow a better navy than we have. And Santo Domingo will be the place to do it. So I can upgrade one trading port. I can dismantle this fishery and get it to build uh, to put a shipyard. And then I can look after this whole area. Cool. Iron. The native native factions are destroyed completely. Cool. Let's hit end turn. Because right now, in general, things are going fairly well. There's no major, no major problems. I mean, obviously, I'm skint, but I'm. Hey, they finally moved. <gasps> oh, too bad the Georgians didn't do more damage to that French fleet, because they foresee war with the French eventually. Oh, I've just realised I do need to build some church schools in India to force them to... Oh, have they just taken Boston as well? Oh, the Spanish are in. Uh, I mean, that's not really a fight, is it? Just to force them off. Clear out. So one thing I would actually be keen to know from you guys is that how do you guys want me to treat this campaign? Because right now it's a long campaign with 40, just to capture 40 regions. Campaign, it performs quite well uh, in the in the rankings. So what I was wondering is that would you guys like me to make the mission campaign? Because it's possible. I mean, I'll be looking to replace my United States campaign with a new world domination. Um, but you guys seem sufficiently enthused with this Denmark campaign that I figure I may as well keep it going. Especially as considering capturing 40 regions isn't that difficult in this game. Um, and I mean, world domination is only a bit of an extension of that, but I figure you guys might be might be interested. There is unused land suitable for plantations so in this region. So they've upgraded here, it's fine. Planted. Aruba has, could be upgraded. But let's just quickly batter this region and then let's try and get peace and trade. They will not accept peace. So, okay, let's try to fold them into my fusiliers. Good. Rank four fusiliers. Okay. Uh, going to lose some infantry that will need to be replaced it would be from, from Curacao however you're all sat here and do I have an actual my fleet is here blockading ships blockading uh, port Pay. store to resolve oh we lost four ships I mean and their fleet is still in existence. Well, that definitely didn't go to plan. Inventor so let's order. get you into port up here in San Juan. Let's get you guys repaired urgently. Well, actually, no, you guys can't repair from a, in a damaged port, can you? So you guys need to go back to here. I'm going to damage the fishery. Upgrade the ships. Let's not upgrade stuff here yet. I mean, basic roads is an easy one. As is upgrading one of these plantations between coffee and sugar. Sugar's worth more. Sugar warehouse in the Leeward Islands. Let's get rid of this general. Let's move my clone of Dragoons to the port. Good. And now you guys can be taxed. Let's recruit a sloop. Okay, let's not do sugar warehouse yet. Let's go and fix. Ooh, there's a Prussian fleet. Let's just go bash it with our main fleet. Lost no ships. No. I'm not going to take it. I'm going to keep. I'm going to keep the money and use it to help rebuild the fleet. 
So now let's try peace. Still won't accept peace with pressure, but that's okay. Just keep them blockaded. So they could, to be honest, they could just storm right. Well, no, they can't cross the Hanoverian territory, with which we're still currently indifferent. I want four grand to trade with Greece. Go on then. Don't normally like paying it, but so how much are you worth? One and a half thousand, it's not bad. The Karnatica garrison's growing. Bruno definitely needs to replenish and let's send one of these sepoys up to chase after Bruno. Hyderabad is more than able to prob well, probably more than able to stand up to this army, so much so that Frederick Carlson is actually probably going to try and move on. Not any of those, because those are lots of armies. Fall back. So, ooh, Frederick, that's dangerous. They might be about to get encircled. Let's keep keep the recruitment going, because we cannot afford to let up. the navy fix the navy and I'll start to send it up to start raiding some of these ports and the army here the recruit general good Gamal Renskold you are the new frontier uh, um, one two so six new units so Two more, two more units. We can probably swing by London, pick up some troops en route. Well, a lot, a lot of troops. <laughs> Actually, you could probably go now. I suppose you could probably go now, but I'd leave lots of good units just sat here not doing anything. Yep, Hispaniolos. Chase, may as well chase down the remnants. Yeah, just auto that. Then send my dragoons on to kick them out of the port. And the port is captured and attacked. Everyone replenishes as much as they can. Santa Domingo still likes me, and they're about to grow a lot more than they thought they would. Awesome. This just reminded me. So, one thing I do need to do is build the army board and the gunnery school to unlock next gen techs. Next turn, artillery and military tech. Because as much as I don't really use wedge formation for my cavalry, I mean, you may as well still have it. Look, Austria's moving on Berlin. Spanish um, Spanish navy's coming back to blockade me. Oh, they might actually drop my drop some troops off in Curacao. No, because I'm about to get wedge formation. I don't care about your four and a half grand. I'm not going to give you all of that. So no. Sorry, Poland. Send our more armies to India will be better because in. Oh. Uh, I mean, I'm not going to help. I mean, I could. Well, I think that's what they. Go on then. VLC Greca. Yeah, go on then. We'll have him. We'll have that fourth rate. Yoink. Cheers, Russia. Yeah, where are you going? If they try to go through and cross this fort, then we will... Yeah, they're attacking us. We're probably going to be okay. Got one gun, lots of annoying troops. But let's defend Hyderabad and this... Well, I sit here and go, this should be fine. It better be fine can't think why it shouldn't be fine. They've not got many good troops. And granted though we've only got sepoys, 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 they, they could still do fire by rank and do lots of good stuff. I might have to quickly breach my own walls though. But that's okay. 
Couldn't bought a coffee so The enemy will try to lines. smash their way in with siege equipment. Use your heaviest troops to defend any breach in the wall. You don't say. Okay, so I'm gonna try and I'm gonna try and blow a hole in my own walls because it might pro should provoke them, give them a nice focus point. Some of my sepoy units up on the main section of the walls to provide some fire. Let's put some fire like armed citizenry in case the trigger on the left. Let's put a unit of another unit of fire like armed citizenry over here. Put some heavy cavalry outside the walls. General inside. Fire at rank off. This weak unit of sepoys go here. Pop down some. Barricades. Done my other infantry. Well, to be honest, my other infantry put down anti cavalry barricades. Don't worry about. Well, I'm not worried about infantry. It's the cavalry that's the concern of it. Good, good, good. If we can blow a hole in the wall, then they will love it. Okay, let's get let's get these guys off of the wall rapidly. Because that was yeah, two volleys and they'll be done. Rather handy to probably have him. Well, I mean, you guys go over here then if you want. You guys take position in this section of the wall. I mean, you fired short. It always seems to be a problem by like dragging to the right. I say that. I immediately try dragging to the right. There we go. Now we've baited the cheese, or baited the trap with the cheese. These bowmen do get past my fire on citizenry, which they will. Here they come. They love a breach. of them. That's a big old block of troops. And there's some camels, but... Yeah, no, I don't need to throw my camels. Don't need to throw my cavalry. I mean, yeah, I could massacre them, but camels are spooky. I'm 
Those will be unfortunate if they respond to this. Go for these guys that are forming back, coming back. Someone's absolutely. Okay, let's flee, because they're about to get... I managed to get some nice kills and no deaths, so just leg it. Especially as the camels are coming. So run back to the safety of the, of the armed peasantry. But they'll have something to say to you. Gunners are shooting at me, although I probably can't pick them back. What are you doing? You were told to flee, because you're probably going to die more likely to then be shot in the back by the armed citizenry. Stay back there and get you, get your energy back. What are you doing back here? Yeah, look, see? He's got shot off his horse. Oh, look at that for a shot. Yeah, this is gonna be this is gonna prove classic for a battle against India. Let's knock the speed down a bit. Far look on citizenry, just pick away these chaps. Be aware they are damaging this section of the wall. section of the wall just in case yeah just speeding it up because right now the AI won't commit their cavalry although they've dismounted some camel gunners which is nice but they won't commit their won't commit everything until the infantry's gone off the field which because it's not going for the they're not going for the breach anymore I suspect they might be trying to like wait for this to be damaged or this to be destroyed the bowmen. I mean, I don't know how good the bowmen... Well, armed citizenry isn't great. I could charge my cavalry in. But there we go, that's what I wanted. I don't want to commit their, ca their camels. There we go. They should all die. Most of them should die on this these defences, but the canister shot should help them. See. Because these guys could actually win against my arm against the armed citizen. Let's just commit my cavalry in. Because their camels are back with the guns. Gunners, you better get those canister shots ready. They've charged the guns, but they won't be there long. Let's 
sad egg. Well, I can, I can charge them. Although, fat lot good it's going to be. No, let's get you guys to stop being silly. Let's keep opening up on the bridge. Come on. Go for the bone, man. Because you're getting picked off. Oh no, you're bugged. GG. They come the camels. Although these guys should get absolutely chopped apart by this heavy cavalry. Round shot the camels through the gap. Speed up time again. Let's just pull my cavalry back. Try luring some of their camel gunners. Which I could just probably sally out. Just run to the right spot and you'll just kill them all. We'll just set them to kill them, but not leave their position. Oh no, they fired a cannonball shot. Right, okay, so what's the best thing to do about this? It could be to Sally. Okay, let's triple speed it. Here come the camels again. Or a new set of camels. Many, many camels have died. Spears, here comes the canister shot. Not out a few of them. Still isn't all of them. Still got one more unit, although that's probably the general. So they're probably gonna not. To be honest, I'm happy to let these guys go, because it doesn't really matter to me very much what they do. It's nice of the general to pass more into our sights. Camel gunners are charging in. Because they've had enough. Oh no. Go on, come in through the breach, please. I mean, they will rout, because they're just light infantry even getting shot at by rubbish infantry still shocking I mean, my cavalry is well and truly bugged so i may as well just send them in Probably gonna have to just send. Okay, let's have a fire with you chaps. Absolutely do not get involved with my cavalry. Let them all set up again and fire into that damn block of. What are you doing? Good. Fire into that damn unit of camel gunners. Just let them. Or camel nomads. Just sit there and plink at that nice big target as the cannons. See, I thought the cannons would have routed, but apparently not. Uh, oh, I thought they were going to prepare to defend their artillery. Apparently not. General's been killed. There he goes. His aid broken. My, my cavalry got absolutely blasted by some cannon ships or some cannon fire. Oh god, there's still a unit out here. Okay. I'm 
bring him out. So what's that? Pikeman and some levy. So let's bring out bring out my general as well. Then let's keep some guys back here. Keeping an eye on the keeping an eye on the Oh wow, they almost destroyed the section of the wall. Didn't even see that. Oh they're they're outing. Excellent. Whew. Bit of a dodgy defence. But it's two thousand men kill. Holy hell. The algorithm was not pick up some more. But they've given us some breathing space. <gasps> and I see those Indian troops. Oh that's not yeah, it's just the remnants of that army. Um yeah. Oh, looking at the timer, that is that will bring me over the time limit. So, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you've enjoyed, and I'll see you next time for the defense of Hyderabad. So I should see you in a second, guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you've enjoyed.